My workout routine, like when I start, um, I've already got my protein shake mixed up and in the fridge. Like it's ready to go for right after. Um, I down my pre-workout mixture, whatever that be, like the nitric oxide booster and pre-workout. Usually I do the Redcon 1's combination of the, uh, what's that called? Total War and uh, Big Noise. Those two together do that. Maybe a little bit of veteran just to, you know, kick it into eighth gear. <laughs> and uh, I smash it out. So shoulder day, love shoulder day. Um, right now, still cutting uh, another week and a half-ish of this cutting, but I still gotta get the workouts in, so I'm gonna smash it hard. So something else I forgot, like I always warm up my shoulders. Uh, I do a bunch of bands, like, ro like external rotations and stuff. I always warm up my shoulders. I know a lot of people have shoulder issues and I have a small shoulder issue. It's not that big of a deal right now, but I just don't want it to get worse, right? So I always make sure I warm up my shoulders. And as well, once I get into my first or second set, I'll eat half a banana, get those uh, good sugars in, hopefully get a good pump going. You know what I mean? Like I want those round shoulders, right? Let's see if we can fill them out today really well. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna go crazy. We're gonna burn them out. We're gonna destroy shoulders today. It's gonna be great. Here we go. So uh, one thing I really like to do is start off with a warm up, like really light weights. Do like 20, 20 reps and then uh, up the weight every time. And every time I up the weight, I drop down to maybe like 15 reps. So like one or two warm up sets and then I get into like three or four real, like the working sets of like 10 to 12 rep ranges and just uh, get the blood flowing, you know, get the muscles working. Feel, feel the blood in the shoulders, you know, get nice and warm and uh, smash it out. Let's go. for the second set. These are just 50 pound dumbbells. Nothing uh, too heavy. Strength is pretty low from cutting for so long. So, I think the most I've ever done in each hand was 75 for like maybe five or eight reps. So, strength definitely takes a huge hit when you're cutting. A week and a half, a week and a half before I start getting the good food in me. So I can build that strength back up. Build those muscles back up. Let's hit this. Whew. Try to get 12 reps. Second set. Let's go.
you really gotta go through that pain barrier. You know, when it starts hurting and that lactic acid builds up, you gotta try and keep going. That's where the growth happens. Get these Arnold presses. It's a little heavy. You don't know when to lower the weight. You don't get a good contraction, you're gonna work out, you gotta lower the weight. So I'm gonna go back down to the 20s, those are 30s. Whoo! Third set. Set of these general presses and finish them off. I'm always, I'm always working around my lower back issues. So I'm, anything that I can find that uh, helps keep the stabilization out of the picture. So like where I can lie down and do this instead of standing there and putting the weight out in front of me, that puts a lot of strain on my core and lower back. Even though I'm always trying to strengthen my core and I do core workouts, I, uh, I'm always trying to find exercises that reduce the risk of me tweaking my back because that sucks. So now it's time for side laterals. Shoulders feel good, warmed up, but uh, side laterals are kind of a weird thing. I go everything by feel, you know? So uh, I've been trying to go a little heavier lately and then I back it off slowly and just rep it out like crazy and get that full shoulder look. So let's hit it hard. Twenties definitely get difficult. And I try not to sway. I try not to put too much sway into it, but man, it gets hard.
start changing angles. Try not to get the, try not to engage the traps. This one on all shoulders. That uh, see that rear delt start to come in. That seven, see how the teardrop shoulder starts coming into the tricep there. That's awesome. That's some craziness right there. All right, take a quick break. I'm gonna go back, start off with the tens, and I'm just gonna keep going like this until I have to start off with the five pounds. And we're gonna mix stuff up. Things get crazy when they're doing side laterals. It just get nuts. I don't want 
want to be done. Side laterals. I just want to keep going. I'm gonna do the same thing for rear laterals. Start heavy, and then I'm just gonna wrap it out. Lower weight, lower weight, lower weight. And just kill them. <laughs>
Knocked out to some traps. Finish off with some front shoulder out raises things. Anything that guy hurt my back or could test it, I leave till the end of the workout so I don't fuck my whole workout. front shoulders until there's nothing left of these bad boys thanks for watching um, I know it's a long video but I just kind of want to go through like how I work out and what I've been doing for uh, like during this diet hopefully I uh, when I get into the bulking phase a couple of weeks here start putting on some size some strength and just go completely crazy till next time guys don't forget to comment like subscribe share this shit with everybody you know